Hey guys, how's it going? Happy, well for you it's probably going to be Thursday. Sorry to upload yesterday, I was busy uh, doing nothing pretty much. It was more of a, uh, just had a couple workouts, but anyway, you guys don't care about that. Um, I'm in my sauna right now, so if the lighting's not perfect, I apologize. I can't put my ring light in here because there's no electricity. Well, there is, but just no outlet. <clears throat> there we go. So I just wanted to uh, kind of talk to you guys about my legitimate goals for the CrossFit Open coming up. It's in about uh, three weeks, I believe, maybe two weeks out now, and it's coming up pretty fast. So just wanted to talk to you guys. I'm going to try to do this as uncut as I can. We'll see how that goes. But let's uh, talk about it. So uh, it's only going to be three weeks this time. Uh, usually the CrossFit Open is roughly four. No, it is five weeks. Usually there's uh, strength piece, conditioning piece, chipper piece, crossfit piece, whatever. Uh, it does a pretty good job of testing us athletes to see who deserves to go on to the second stage of crossfit competition. So for me, last year, I believe I finished, I think it was like 12 or 15,000 worldwide. Um, I was about 135 pounds at the time. Um, most of the RX workouts, I could not do RX uh, efficiently. For example, uh, I think it was 20.1, I believe. It was, I want to say, 10 rounds of uh, 8 clean and jerks, or 8 ground to overhead. You could clean that or you could uh, snatch that. And then 10 burpees over bar. I remember that one. Uh, it was 95 pounds RX. Um, I obviously did RX, but I remember that workout. It was really, really uh, tough for me. Um, I couldn't really uh, power snatch 95 pounds worth of crap at the time, uh, like cycle it. I could power snatch it, but I couldn't cycle it. So that was a big issue for me. Uh, most people, I think, uh, cycled 95 pound power snatch pretty well. Again, I was only like 135 pounds at the time. Um, I think that this year I've done a better job of knowing my paces, uh, knowing what, what and when to push, you know what I mean? What workout to push on, what workout to kind of hold back on. Um, I think that a deadlift for me, 315, last year was super, super heavy. It was basically my max. Um, I'm roughly 150 right now, and I can deadlift 355, so still kind of suck at cycling 315 as a deadlift, but some of my uh, weaknesses last year were the handstand push-ups for sure. I have done a crap load of handstand push-ups the past four months. Um, usually two or three wads a week has handstand push-ups in them or deadlifts, so deadlifts and handstand push-ups were definitely one of my weaknesses. Um, I've done some longer uh, lung burning workouts that, uh, yeah, they suck, to be honest. Uh, any bike, biker, uh, row, anything, if you guys have been on that and you're doing a Metcon, it kind of sucks, especially when it's like 30 minutes long. But I think my cardio is really good. My strength numbers have went up a lot. Um, still not where they need to be to be really competitive, but I think... You have to make top 15,000, maybe it's top 10,000 worldwide to go on to the next stage of CrossFit competition. Which brings me to my next point. So I think that I can probably, if I really put my heart out into these three workouts, again it's only three workouts, I think I can maybe make top eight to 10,000 if the workouts are bad for me. If the workouts are good for me, I'd really like to make top 6,000 worldwide. And that's saying a lot. That's like the top 5%. That's that's pretty big. Um, I know just by working out at the gym, uh, just speaking on myself, not trying to pat myself on the back or anything, um, there's a couple games athletes there. I can keep pace with them. Some of the weights are a little bit heavy for me, but I can still keep pace with them. So physically, I feel fit enough to keep pace with them. There's a lot of people at my gym that crush me. It doesn't matter what workout it is, light, heavy, 
body weight, whatever, they crush me. And I know some of those uh, some of those days are a little bit harder to do. Some of, sometimes you just have a really, really good gym day. Um, but I think six to eight thousand worldwide is not out of the ball field. Um, again, I train all year for this these couple weeks, and I'm ready to I'm ready to uh, put down the hammer and uh, do my best. I guess. Uh, I'm pretty excited to test where I'm at physically. Um, I would really like to do a couple more competitions. I know last year CrossFit Duratus held the Lincoln. Obviously they couldn't do it this year unfortunately because of the Open. Or not the Open, but because of COVID. See what happens when I go and cut. I screw it up. But we're still rolling. Uh, so my goal is top six to 8,000 worldwide if the events are good and then uh, do a couple uh, kind of competitions. Um, I know CrossFit Fort Vancouver is not too far from me. I think that's one that I could do. Uh, there's just a couple around there. Um, when I come to Cookville, I can't wait to work out with those guys. That's what I'm super excited for. This Open is going to be a good one, but I think next year is going to be great. So. That's kind of where I'm at, open goals. Um, I've gained weight like I wanted to. I know I've said it in previous videos. My diet has gotten a lot better. Um, I'm now taking creatine, so I'm just feeling strong and ready to go. We're now almost seven minutes in. I think I did really good at this. Uh, so that's kind of my goals for open. If you have any questions, let me down below. If you are thinking about signing up and not sure, sign up. Just do it. I promise you it will be worth it. So that's where I'm at. If you have any questions, let me down put, put them down below. I can't talk right now. Um, I'm gonna finish up my re sauna recovery and we're gonna go back to gym for a good rest of the week. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Maybe you'll like it if you're feeling good. I uh, love you guys. We'll see you guys on the next one. I think this one deserves it. Don't forget to stay fit. Peace.